of at the station, sorry. And it's now like pouring rain. <laughs> so that's fun. The weird thing is, is it's actually fairly sunny. So, like, I don't know where this rain came from. But it's coming down. And now I'm wearing very thin pants. So my legs are wet. But it's okay, because it's actually pretty, pretty outside. afternoon now. I haven't filmed anything this morning because I've been doing some other stuff. It's the 17th of March, it's a Wednesday, and it's mine and my boyfriend's anniversary. So I'm about to get ready for our date and I thought that I would film myself getting ready I guess. Not very exciting but my life's not very exciting right now. Just had a small interruption. But what was I saying? Life's not very interesting. Yes. What is exciting is that tomorrow is the start of our fundraiser yay we're going to be starting our three gear day and i am very excited i'm also very nervous one because i don't run often i'm not really someone that does that i've never really been someone that does that and now i'm gonna have to run daily and I, like I did 3k the other day and it's not that bad, like it's fine, it's very doable but it's been horrible weather here and it's just gonna keep being horrible weather here and so I'm gonna have to get out in the rain and run 3k every day, no excuses for two weeks. So I'm quite nervous about that. Holy crap! The main reason why I'm nervous is that I'm super nervous that this is just gonna fail. I'm not gonna lie. We've, me and Corinne have been texting about it because I'm not at our house right now. And I'm just, what if we don't raise any money? What if it just fails? It's gonna make me so sad. <laughs> Honestly, even if we raised one pound, I think I would be ecstatic. But really, that's not the aim. Like, I'd like to raise a lot because I really want to raise money for this family. But yeah. Anyway, so I'm kind of nervous it might fail. Like I said, it's one of my boyfriend's first one year anniversary today. We dated all throughout covid and we have never really been on like a proper outside the house date once when things opened up a bit over the summer but because i went home to visit family for most of the summer we went together so we do a lot of like netflix dates going on walks and making dinner and our first date was actually exactly exactly that we went on a walk we made dinner together and then we watched the office but today we thought we'd do something a bit different because we always Always watch Netflix together. We are going to do like a little challenge thing. I've seen a lot of them online. So we're gonna be like going to our local shop and we have given ourselves a little budget for like a fiver, so five euros for those who don't speak British. Five euros and we're going to have to buy, it's our favorite snack, like the other person's favorite snack, favorite food and something that we can do together. It'll be interesting. I don't know how it'll work, but I'm excited. So I'm getting myself ready, putting some nice makeup on. I don't really do that much. Also, I just wanna say a thank you to all the people that commented on our story on Instagram the other day say that they're going to be joining us for 3k a day because it literally made us so happy that people that we know obviously but also people that we don't know commented and said that they were going to be joining us it really honestly that made us so so happy the whole idea behind this was that we reached people that we we didn't know as well as people that we knew but it makes us so happy when we see things like that and also in case you didn't know this is just going to be the first fundraiser of many the plan behind our fundraising group is that we we work by a fa family by family. I think we're going to be sticking with adoption stories just because we like are really enjoying getting to know like the adoption community. We fundraise family by family so we're going to be working on fundraising for Emily and her family until they have the money that they need. And we wanted to start with a fundraiser that would allow us to kind of spread awareness a bit so like not necessarily raise loads of money but get the word out. I mean obviously we always aim to raise money but we kind of wanted to spread 
awareness and build up our following so that our next fundraisers could actually achieve raising a lot of money. So we're starting with this one and we don't really know where we want to go next. We're thinking some kind of an auction or something. It's a little bit difficult with COVID, but we've been speaking to another fundraising like group who do similar and we've got some tips from them. And I actually ran some auctions when I was in high school or secondary school. So I know kind of what it takes to run one. Thinking of doing that next, but we don't really know yet. So we'll let you guys know once we know. But yeah, this is just going to be the first one of many and we're really excited about it. And we really hope that you guys enjoy like joining with us. We're always going to try and have an element that allows um, you all to be involved because we really like the idea of like having it be a group helping other people. That's why we called ourselves a group, but also that's why we use the word friended, which means friends, because we want it to be like friends helping other friends um, and like if we build up groups so there's more and more people helping out then it's like yeah reaches more people so we always want to have an element that allows you guys to help and get involved as well and i mean we have said this so many times and we've posted this so many times but if you are just finding us through youtube then our instagram page is tagged in the comments uh, in the description box down below so go and take it take a look at it we are a fundraising group and we are currently raising money for a family who is going through an adoption and um trying to keep their family together so yeah basically go and check it out go and check out their story the gofundme is also linked in the description box below and their youtube and their social media etc so go and check them all out um and also yeah so our first fundraiser is a um a sponsored run 3k a day for two weeks so it will add up to being a marathon. And you guys can get involved. We'd love for you guys to get involved. You can run with us or walk. Either way, all you have to do is run a walk 3K each day for two weeks. Take a photo, tag us in it, share it, hashtag 3K a day. Yeah, let us know that you're joining because we'd love to know. And then share our posts to as many people as possible if we can get the word out to more and more people that would be amazing so yeah share with your friends share with your families and of course if you can donate sponsor us um on the gofundme page donate there any amount of money would be amazing and if you can reference vfg in the reference when you donate then that would be amazing just so that we can have an idea of if we're actually making a difference if we're raising some money so we'd love to know those things but yeah that's how you can get involved to just finding us or if you're not and um thank you so much for following along if you haven't already subscribe down below drop us a like and a comment and yeah we hope you enjoy the rest of this video okay have my mask on got ready heading out to the shops to start our challenge take you guys along with me so once again we have to find one favorite drink favorite snack and something to do together and we have a budget of five euros okay so i have to talk quiet but i'm just in puzzle to do together okay well the shops were really really loud and there were a lot of people in them and they were pretty small shops so it didn't really feel appropriate to film but i did find everything i wanted kind of not really i can't say what i found because the person's in the room so i'll just have to show you in our review The challenge was a success. We actually did very well. And we got some good things to do together now. So we are going to make this giant thousand piece puzzle. Play Never Have I Ever with crispy M&Ms, which was something we did on another day. And drink our favorite drinks. And order some food. It is now 
now Thursday um and it is the day of our fundraiser well the beginning of it we're so excited can't wait we've just posted on Instagram about it and yeah I'm gonna go and do my run for it later I just thought I'd give a quick update to this video also because this will probably be one of the last things that will be in it I'm gonna yeah probably film running or something I don't know but yeah uh last night was really nice ordered some pizza and tried to do a puzzle which <laughs> still doing today because it takes is like a thousand pieces and takes forever but yeah it's our fundraiser so if you haven't already or if you're just catching us on YouTube then go to our Instagram page, check out how you can get involved. We'd love to have more people running with us and we're really excited about um, seeing everyone's pictures. So yeah, thank you so much for joining along and we love having you all. Okay, for those who didn't see the Instagram video, I'll do one for YouTube as well. I just finished my 3K I'm out in the middle of nowhere, vineyards, some farms, and then I'm on a, like a road out of town. But yeah, I didn't plan super well today, so I actually ended up just 3K away from home. So now I get to run back, so it's a little longer, but that's okay. It's always good to get out. The weather's finally nice. I've been stuck inside since the weather's been so garbage this week, but yeah, beautiful day. Nice gray sky, but it's not raining. It's fairly warm. All right, I'm back. Sweaty faced, red. My hair looks fantastic. It's because I've been keeping it in a braid for the last two days and I just took it out because I'm gonna go shower. Ooh, I look like a mermaid. Love this. Love this for me. Um, yeah, so today went really well. I ended up running 5.3 kilometers actually. So that's good, great start. I'll probably be really tired tomorrow, which is good because yeah, I don't know if I'll be doing the whole route I did today, tomorrow, um, but it was great. Like the weather was nice, it was nice getting out and it was nice that we're doing this for a good cause. I'm really excited about this fundraiser and um, we have a lot of people who are posting and joining with us, so it's really exciting to that we're all kind of joining together. We're in different countries all around the world, so I'm really excited about this. And I know Sezi is too. She'd be here like, yeah, <laughs> but we are apart for now. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna make some lunch now and shower. <laughs> Except my hair looks so good, I don't know. Maybe I'll wait until tonight, I don't know. Yeah, and then tomorrow is a new day. I'm going up to uh, my boyfriend's for the weekend. We're gonna help his grandma in the yard. And then Sezzy and I are meeting up and we're going to our little beach vacation. So I'm excited about that. We'll get to see some, uh, or do some walks and runs on the beach or in the little like beach town. Not that anything's gonna be open, but it'll just be fun to like go around. Like I've looked at pictures and it looks like a cute little village and there's a lighthouse and everything. So I'm thrilled. Oh, my hair. <laughs> but yeah, so it's a good day. I've been editing a video and now it's raining, which is really typical, but I'm going to start to go out and do 3K day now. So this is the first of many and I will update you when I get there. We're halfway through. I've done about one half K, I hope. Um, it's not that bad. The weather's a lot better than when we did it the other day because it was like really windy the other day. Today it's not that bad, so. One and a half more K to do. And then day one is complete. So we will catch you guys on the first. Hey guys, so we're just finishing up this week's video. Um, just wanted to remind you to subscribe, like our videos, um, follow us on Instagram if you haven't. Just, we're just at Freedom Fundraising Group and let us know if you're joining our fundraiser. We're really excited that we got to get it started this week and we're excited to be sharing more content about that next week. We have 13 more days if you count today, <laughs> which I am. <laughs> um, but yeah, just uh, join along if you want to. It's for a really great cause, for a really great family and yeah, we're excited to be sharing it with all of you guys.